Hi everyone, in this video we'll see how to make a stinger for OBS which is basically a transparent video and it's a very cool uh, thing to do uh, but uh, it isn't so easy to do in uh, Linux because uh, almost every instruction I found were for Windows for After Effects but uh, we also can do it in Linux with free software and I will use Olive Video Editor. So I won't do a much uh, complicated stinger. And if you didn't understand what is a stinger, it's this kind of transition. So uh, you see it in Twitch videos, but also on YouTube. And it's this. And color scheme as well. So did you see that there is a transition with uh, an image? And when uh, the image uh, pass away, you get the uh, other uh, kind of uh, camera. And uh, this is uh, the stinger effect. So I will load it again. A brand color scheme as well as your logo. It's this one. So you swap the cameras uh, with uh, this effect. Uh, so uh, you can do it uh, with uh, a video editor which support uh, a special kind of uh, export format and just to do a test I will do a new sequence this is the Olive video editor okay and now uh, just to test it I will put uh, um, I don't know a title so test but uh, it could also be uh, an image it's it's better that uh, it's an image because uh, you have to cover all the screen with uh, this kind of effect so we put uh, a solid color here and this is red Okay, so uh, you can make the animation with it. So let's do here. We put uh, a keyframe. Okay. And then uh, here we have uh, another keyframe. And you have to color all the black part to, to have uh, the nice effect. Okay, this is a little bit slower, but uh, it's just to test the transparency. And uh, as you can see, this is black, but uh, you need the transparent color. And uh, to do it, you need to export this uh, movie, this uh, video in a special format so here uh, file export so you pick quicktime mov and here you pick uh, quicktime animation rle video and now in advanced you can pick the argb so this is the format which allow to have a transparent background because as you can see this is black but it is transparent but only this kind of codec as far as I know it's the one which support the transparency so I do export and I put it in the desktop Trasp. okay we we have it and uh, it's uh, it seems a normal video if you open uh, with a video player but uh, if you drag it uh, again uh, in olive or another editor so we do import it's better transparent 
and uh, now this color beca uh, became uh, I don't know yellow and I put uh, this video over and uh, as you can see it's it's transparent so uh, okay uh, we have uh, it's better we remove <laughs> the old one so we add again a solid color and we say it's yellow and as you can see the uh, red animation now it's uh, below the yellow or the background color or stuff you have so that's it thanks for watching uh, give me a thumbs up if you found uh, this video useful and see you next time. Bye.